Hello students, let's learn about the life cycle of animals. Look at the pictures given. A dog and its puppy, a cat and its kitten, they look similar. In the same way, a kid and a fully grown goat are not very different to look at. There is not much difference between a kitten and an adult cat. These babies grow in their mother's tummy and are born from the mother's tummy too. These animals are known as viviparous. Some animals lay eggs. Ants, butterflies, fish, frogs, snakes are all animals that lay eggs. The animals that lay eggs are called oviparous. The eggs of some very small animals are very tiny. We would hardly notice them. Let's see the growth of a hen. A hen lays egg. Warmth is necessary for the chicks to grow inside the egg. So after laying them, the hen sits on the eggs to keep them warm. The chicks inside slowly keep growing. When its growth is complete, the chick breaks the egg shell and comes out. So this is a life cycle of a hen. Let's see what is metamorphosis. There are similarities between a goat and its kid and between a hen and her chick. However, a caterpillar and a butterfly are very different. Thus, in some animals, the young one grows into an adult animal that looks very different from the young one. This change of form is called metamorphosis. Let's learn about the life cycle of a butterfly. Butterflies of various shapes and beautiful colors are a part of our environment. They live their life among plants. As butterflies grow, they pass through four stages. These are egg, larva, pupa and adult. The adult stage is called butterfly. Let's learn each stage in detail. Here we take the example of a female plain tiger butterfly. It lays eggs on the milkweed leaf. In 6 to 8 days, the larva emerges from the egg. The larva of a butterfly is called the caterpillar. When the caterpillar comes out of the egg, it is very hungry. It begins to nibble and eat the very leaf on which it emerges from the egg. It eats very fast, so its growth is rapid. The caterpillar of the plain tiger butterfly grows so rapidly in the first two or three days that it does not fit in its skin anymore. But under the old skin, a new loose skin is formed on the growing caterpillar. Then the caterpillar sheds the old skin, that is it molds. Again, it begins to gobble up the leaf and continues to grow rapidly. In two or three days, it molds a second time. In this way, it molds four times. It remains in the caterpillar stage for 10 to 12 days. After the fourth mold, the caterpillar goes into the next stage. This is the pupa stage. The pupa stage of a butterfly is called a chrysalis. It has a protective case at this stage. This is also called a chrysalis. It remains inside the chrysalis for the next 11 or 12 days. It does not eat anything during this stage. However, inside the chrysalis, important changes take place in its body. For example, its legs grow longer, it gets attractive wings, its growth is completed inside the chrysalis. Then the adult butterfly emerges from the chrysalis. All butterflies go through these stages of growth. Remember, animals that give birth to young ones are called viviparous. And the animals that lay eggs are called oviparous. Thank you.